Hello and welcome. In this tutorial, we'll look at some of the ways of working in the patch browser to locate sounds in the Reason Soul School refill. Let's start with an empty song document. Select Create Instrument from the Create menu to bring up the patch browser. Now, let's navigate to the Reason Soul School refill. The Reason Soul School refill features three main style categories, Cincinnati, Detroit, and Memphis. These category folders contain Rex loops and multi-sampled instrument patches that mimic some of the most famous soul styles of all time. Each category contains a vast amount of drum, bass, guitar and horn loops and various tempi, keys and playing styles. In each category, there are a number of groove folders that contain drum and instrument loops recorded at a specific tempo and playing style. The loops in each groove folder are tailored to match each other. By loading instruments from the same groove folder, you can quickly build up really tight grooves. If we look in the Groove 1 folder in the Detroit category and open the Guitar 1 folder, we can see all guitar loops used in this particular groove. Let's select this one. Now, let's add a bass loop from the same category and groove folder. Sounds good. Now, let's add a drum loop from the same category and groove folder. In each category, there is also an Instrument Patches folder, which contains various Combinator and NNXT instrument sounds based on the same sounds that are used in the loops. Even though the loops and instruments are divided into separate categories and grooves, you can, of course, mix and match loops and instrument patches from different categories. For example, to list all guitar loops and guitar patches of the entire refill, double-click on the Reason Soul School refill icon in the Browse list. Then type Guitar in the search box and click the Find button. Now, all guitar loops and all guitar patches from all grooves and styles in the Reason Soul School refill are listed. Now, you can select whichever guitar loop or guitar patch you like without having to navigate to specific folders first. As you can see, the loops begin with a number and letter. These indicate which groove folder and category folder the loop belongs to. For example, this guitar loop begins with 1C, which means it's from the Groove 1 folder in the Cincinnati category. This search procedure can be used for the other instrument loops and patches in the refill as well. Just remember to click the Back button to return to the Refill folder route before performing the new search. If you want to list all bass loops and bass patches of the refill, type in Bass in the search field and click Find. To search for drum loops and drum patches, type in Drums. And for horn loops and patches, type in horns. If you need sounds in certain keys, the search function also allows you to find those loops. Just type the key in the search box, hit enter, and boom! Now you can easily find a guitar loop matching your beat. So, that's how you can use the Patch Browser to easily search for loops and sounds in your songs. 